Hippos are known to swim underwater. In reality, they sink as soon as they enter the water. Their bodies aren't very buoyant, so they're not very good swimmers. In the water, hippos propel themselves forward by holding onto the bottom. Then, they leap out of the water to the surface. Because of this aquatic lifestyle, hippos can't swim in water that's too deep or they will drown if the water is too deep or if there is no terrain to leap over. However, even though they are simply walking underwater, their speed exceeds the swimming speed of many animals. Their underwater jumps are so powerful that they can reach the surface in a single leap from the bottom of the water. So, even though they can't swim, hippos don't have any problems living underwater. They can hold their breath underwater for up to 5 minutes. When they exhale, they pop up to the surface and exhale water vapor through their nostrils. This is the same way whales make a stream of water at the surface. That was the first story about hippos. A jellyfish is a single, unisex animal with a jelly-like body and numerous tentacles. They are primitive creatures that have lived in the ocean for 600 million years and have no eyes, nose, ears, brain, or heart. It appears to swim in repetitive motions, but it's very weak, so it mostly just lets the current carry it along. Its main food is plankton and small fish. It grabs its prey with its tentacles, paralyzes it with its venomous sting, eats it in its mouth, and excretes it back into its mouth. Natural enemies include sunfish and sea turtles, which are said to be resistant to jellyfish venom, rendering stinging attacks ineffective. Jellyfish are prolific and ubiquitous in the ocean, making them an important part of the marine ecosystem. Jellyfish have a fluorescent protein in their bodies that gives them a mysterious glow. This protein is a valuable research material in the genetic engineering world. Thousands of jellyfish are caught off the coast of the United States each year and sent to laboratories. The jellyfish's venom is deadly to humans. 
Of all the sea creatures, jellyfish cause the most casualties. If a swarm of jellyfish shows up, the beach is immediately closed. Each jellyfish's venom varies in strength, with some causing little more than an itch. While others can sting and kill within five hours. Global warming and coastal pollution are driving subtropical jellyfish to South Korea's shores, and the country's fisheries industry has a lot to worry about. It may seem simple enough to catch them all and sell them as food, but out of hundreds of jellyfish species, only four are edible.